common way to that insurance companies use to reduce the amount that they pay on claims with both lawyers and with I would assume with clients or people who represent themselves is they scare them. And one of the things they use is they use a little bit of knowledge. And for example, people know that the law requires in Maryland for you to wear a seatbelt. In fact, if you don't wear a seatbelt, you get a ticket if you get pulled over. You get a citation, and oftentimes you have to appear in criminal court. Insurance companies in civil cases are using that frequently when they're negotiating deals in cases where clients were injured, and they claim part of their injury was caused, in fact, by the fact they weren't wearing a seatbelt. They can't do that. Maryland Transportation Article 22-412.3H says a couple things, and it's important. One, the fact that a person was not wearing a seatbelt cannot come into evidence. It also cannot be used to show that they were partially at fault. And more importantly, it can't be used in any manner to reduce the amount of damages. In other words, people believe, wow, I wasn't wearing a seatbelt, so I must have done something wrong. And that's true. You might have done something wrong. And, and the fact is, you could have been you could have gotten a criminal citation, but it can't be reduced to limit the amount of recovery in an auto accident case.